வெல்கம் டு ஸ்ரீ கேத்தைங்கா வெல்கம் டு ஸ்ரீ கேத்தைங்கா யா ஃபியூ டேஸ் எகோ ஒய் ஹாவ் டிஸ்கஸ்டு த வெயிட்டேஜ் அனாலிசிஸ் ஆஃப் ஜெய்இ மெயின் ட்வெண்ட்டி ட்வெண்ட்டி மேதமேட்டிக்ஸ் பேப்பர்ஸ் அண்ட் த வெயிட்டேஜ் அண்ட் கான்செப்ட் வைஸ் வெயிட்டேஜ் டாபிக் அண்ட் சப் டாபிக் வைஸ் வெயிட்டேஜ் அனாலிசிஸ் தட் ஹாவ் தட் ஐ ஹவ் கிவன் எஸ்பெஷலி இன் ஆல்ஜிப்ரா அண்ட் கேல்குலஸ் நவ் திஸ் இஸ் அபவுட் கோஆர்டினேட் ஜியாமெட்ரி டுடே ஐ ஆம் கான்சன்ட்ரேட்டிங் பிகாஸ் ஆஃப்டர் ஆல்ஜிப்ரா அண்ட் கேல்குலஸ் கோஆர்டினேட் ஜியாமெட்ரி ஹேஸ் வெரி குட் வெயிட்டேஜ் அண்ட் ஆஃப்கோர்ஸ் மை டியர் ஃப்ரெண்ட்ஸ் திஸ் இஸ் வெரி வெரி யூஸ்ஃபுல் ஃபார் ட்வெண்ட்டி ட்வெண்ட்டி ஒன் ஜெய் ஆஸ் ஃப்ரெண்ட்ஸ் மெயின்லி ஹியர் ஐ ஆம் ஃபோக்கஸிங் மேத்ஸ் யூனிட் வைஸ் டாபிக் அண்ட் கான்செப்ட் வைஸ் அனாலிசிஸ் and this with the help of this information uh, you can strengthen your preparation uh, for je uh, 2021 and my friends uh, as you know je 2020 was conducted in a uh, two shifts one is on uh, january uh, on 7th uh, 8th 9th and another one is uh, recently on september uh, second third fourth fifth and sixth so total 8 days 16 slots 16 tests under 3 subjects 1200 questions they have conducted the je main 2020 examination of that my friends in 8 days 16 slots 16 papers among that 16 papers the contribution of mathematics was 400 questions because mathematics 400 and physics 400 chemistry 400 so all together it is what 1200 questions now we are concentrating on exclusively 400 questions of mathematics of that recently i have completed um, the uh, weightage analysis and uh, topic wise uh, sub topic wise concept wise analysis of uh, algebra and calculus today i am concentrating what coordinate geometry see as i said algebra play a very good role in the entire mathematics because i have divided the entire mathematics into five parts one is uh, algebra the weightage for algebra is 45% second one is uh, calculus and weightage allotted for calculus was uh, uh, 30% now third one is uh, coordinate geometry weightage allotted for uh, coordinate geometry out of 400 13 percent questions were given and uh, next comes to vectors 3d the weightage is uh, given for uh, uh, vectors and 3d was 9% in 2020 je main examination only now coming to the trigonometry this was uh, that is fifth one and uh, 3 percent weightage was given <clears throat> so okay now we are concentrating on coordinate geometry so in coordinate geometry of uh, 50 questions which concepts under which topic they are concentrated more this is very very important because in your preparation also if you have been concentrated on this particular topics and uh, concepts uh, and if you are preparing the formula and the theory uh, uh, under these particular areas uh, you will strengthen more and uh, you will gain very good marks in a short span of the time also one uh, and once again once after uh, releasing the final information of uh, je main 21 2021 uh, i will give um, uh, prep, uh, preparation strategies and uh, preparation techniques and if possible concept wise uh, model questions also with uh, with the shortcuts uh, tips and tricks uh, if you after watching this video you please mention your opinion then only i will present otherwise uh, please don't give uh, unnecessary comments or unnecessary things because uh, with whole heartedly i am doing the best to the some kind of the students if you are utilizing this as with my experience i am sure definitely you will get very good marks or result in 2021 je mains okay now friends in je main 2020 coordinate geometry this was the topic wise analysis from straight lines straight lines means uh, 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 even coordinate system uh, locus uh, change of axis and straight lines including pair of straight lines uh, It, it, though pair of straight lines as a chapter it is not in the in the straight lines but uh, as a part and parcel they may ask sometimes the concepts from pair of straight lines also very very important but anyhow i have divided the entire coordinate geometry in four parts one is uh, straight lines uh, and from straight lines uh, out of uh, 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 what, what i mentioned previously how many questions were given 50 questions out of 50 questions uh, um, 
10 questions were given uh, so 20 percent weightage is there for uh, straight lines and second one is uh, circles uh, uh, 13 questions were given out of 50 that is 26 percent weightage is given and uh, third one is uh, parabola and uh, for that uh, nine questions were given that is 18 percent and uh, fourth one is ellipse and hyperbola uh, because uh, majority of the questions are uh, uh, mixed oriented problems they have given or they, ha are they asked exclusively from ellipse and hyperbola number of questions were given uh, as of 18 uh, that is 30 36 percent okay in a straight case uh, among the 10, 10 questions what concepts are they have concentrated so 10 questions are distributed like this so my friends this is very very important information for you so <coughs> see first one applications of centroid ortho center and of a triangle see actually it comes under what uh, uh, coordinate system though it is a coordinate system my my suggestion would be you please practice all the important information centroid and circumcenter and in center ortho center and their properties of a triangle and moreover equilateral triangle than the areas related all questions you need to practice because two questions were asked among 10 the questions are very simple and uh, some of the questions one can solve with uh, direct formula and methods also but if you have familiar with that the problems are very easy for you and moreover uh, for right angle triangle how to identify the ortho center and uh, for equilateral triangle also that kind of uh, simple relevant questions one should practice especially under this sub concept or concept okay now coming to the next one applications of area of the triangle with respect to vertices yeah so two questions were given uh, under this particular heading actually area of the triangle with respect to vertices means two vertices uh, they, they directly three vertices they may give or uh, three lines uh, as a sides they may give or uh, and if area is given and two sides uh, two vertices of the triangle are given find the vertex of the third vertex uh, like that kind of problems also they asked once again i am repeating three vertices of the triangle are given and find area that is one aspect three sides of the triangle are given and find the area of the triangular that is another aspect but two any two of two vertices and area of the triangle are given and how to find the third vertex that kind of problems are also very very important anyhow under this particular subheading two questions were asked now coming to applications of images or reflections even light problems from uh, uh, applications of ray of course, the say, same type of questions you will uh, uh, get uh, in our NCRT test books also. And straight away, the questions are asked from image, image point of view, foot of the perpendicular point of view. And two questions were asked in this particular area. Of course, you have very good uh, standard formula also be there. And if you can apply that one, you can get the answer very easily. But uh, angle of incidence uh, and the angle of uh, reflection, both are same. You have, you need to apply that fundamental while solving the problems of uh, finding images or reflection. For use that fundamental. Even uh, that application is also useful for physics in physics also. So anyhow, two questions were asked under applications of image and reflection of a point with respect to a line or a line with respect to another line like that questions. Okay, now coming to perpendicular bisector and locus problems related with that. That means if two points are given, uh, what is perpendicular bisector of uh, line joining the two points and uh, midpoints of the locus of the perpendiculars of line joining two points. Uh, like the kinds of questions they asked and based on that two questions were asked in JE Main 2020 among 50 questions of 10 strike lines, two questions were asked under this particular concept. Now coming to family of concurrent lines, as I said earlier, even in our previous videos also I mentioned this very clearly, this is the most favorite area for all competitive examinations, especially in coordinate geometry, L1 plus lambda L2 equal to 0. So this is what family of concurrent lines, this, uh, <coughs> this, is, this, is, this represents what set of family of lines passing through a fixed point. What is the coordinate of point? Like that uh, family of lines, uh, concurrent lines and applications, uh, they asked uh, even the concept is useful even for curve versus line and two different curves uh, also. And one question they asked among 10. 
Now coming to <coughs> applications of distance between parallel lines. Though they are not giving uh, directly parallel lines, uh, somewhat uh, tricky uh, information they may add. Uh, and uh, But anyhow, ultimately they are asking the distance between the parallel lines and uh, distance between a point and a line. The, um, uh, like that kind of questions they asked and one question uh, they, they asked among 10 uh, from straight lines exclusively under this particular applications. So my friends, all the 10 problems uh, are distributed under these subtopics like this only. This is about straight lines. Now coming to the circles. After circles, uh, straight lines, uh, circles uh, has a very good role and 13 questions were asked among 50 questions. Uh, of that first one is uh, applications of line versus circle. What is line versus circle? Heading and simple concept. Heading is very simple. But uh, what magic uh, uh, a line can do with the circle? So, a line uh, can uh, intersect the circle or if it intersects at uh, two different points, a chord may form or a chord of contact may form, chord with respect to midpoint may form, all that kind of applications. So, whenever a line intersects a circle, what kind of things that we can imagine that uh, they are very, very important, all that applications are useful and seven questions were asked exclusively from this area. So, please do not underestimate this one, all uh, points regarding line versus circle, whether it is a card, if it is a card, how to find the length of the card, if it intersect two different points, what is midpoint, what is perpendicular bisector, what is images, what is maximum minimum values, what is area of the other curves, area of the triangle formed by that line with another lines, everything, all applications of, of line versus circle. So, it is a very, very important area and you need to focus more on this particular one. After that, of course, this is the common one and uh, this is the universal uh, um, uh, part of uh, coordinate geometry. What is the equation of the tangent and it normal and common tangent? So, what is the equation of the tangent to the circle? Of course, it is also a part and parcel of line versus circle. But I'm, I have separated this in, into a line and a tangent point of view, or tangent and a normal point of view. But here, they concentrated what is the tangent, tangent equation of the tangent at a point. In, if parametric equations are given, then also how to find the equation of the tangent normal. And moreover, wh what are the properties of tangents and normal of a circle? And uh, if, 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 uh, conditions at which common tangents for the circles, uh, common tangent to circle and uh, parabola like type of problems, uh, all varieties of uh, tangents normal and common tangent related problems and their conditions and their formulae are very, very important to uh, focus more on this. See, among these two only, 15, 12 questions were covered. Only rest of the thing is the maximum minimum applications of intersecting. As I said, now uh, 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 with that lines, uh, sometimes uh, a triangle may form or some other uh, areas may form and if that uh, uh, some calculation applications uh, through that one, uh, they are asking or they are constructed all maximum minimum oriented problems with intersecting of two circles. Uh, and even with the intersecting of two circles also, what is common chord and what is the length of the common chord? Okay, one question they asked in that area. See my friends, actually in, in a calculus section also, I stressed more on this part. All problems related with maxima and minima, whether it is from maxima minima topic directly or the applications of maxima minima in all other topics like coordinate geometry and trigonometry, all are very, very important. So, please need to focus more on this. But uh, among circles, under these two topics only, they have given very good weightage. Now, coming to parabola. In conic sections, actually, in parabola, out of 59 questions they asked, and of that 9 questions, applications of section formula with respect to the parabola, they asked one question. Section formula means what? If uh, um, what is uh, if coordinates of the point of joining uh, point of uh, co coordinates of the point which divides uh, the line segment joining the points A and B in the ratio L is three. So if parabola equation parabola is given in the form of a parametric form, and if uh, a point which divides the line segment joining two points uh, where the two points are in the form of a parametric points or T points of the parabola in the ratio or something, then based on the locus type of problems, uh, they asked it and they are very standard questions also. I think uh, old JE questions are also be there and one question they asked this time in this one. Again, our favorite area, tangent, normal, common tangents and it applications, so five questions were asked. So, 
what is a tangent to the parabola and what is normal to the parabola what is a comma card of the parabola and what is a common tangent to the parabola and circle circle and ellipse ellipse and hyperbola all type of common tangents formulas and everything this is very very hottest topic and called with respect to midpoint concept so totally under this heading five questions were asked among the nine now again area of the triangle and the rectangle with respect to the parabola this is another one so okay based on uh, any uh, two uh, suppose two points uh, two vertices are lies on uh, uh, parabola and another two vertices uh, are given outside the parabola total a figure is formed which is nothing but a square or a rectangle or uh, rhombus or whatever it may be then what is about the area or maximum area or minimum area inscribed in the rectangle uh, in, in the parabola and like that kind of questions triangle and rectangle versus parabola type of application oriented problems are important totally uh, three questions were asked under this heading so you need to practice more on this particular area now my friends coming to ellipse and hyperbola actually after parabola out of 50 questions highest weightage is given for uh, uh, ellipse and hyperbola because uh, Actually, here in ellipse and hyperbola, you need not to concentrate on uh, difficult topics. Only they have concentrated on the elementary topics. What are the elementary topics? What is foci, focus? What are vertices? What is eccentricity? What is a latus rectum and the length of the latus rectum? What is the chord of contact? What is uh, in, even they have not asked pole, polar, etc., etc. type of problems also. Only based on this, different type of varieties. Suppose uh, uh, they may ask uh, common focus, uh, uh, focus, common focus problems uh, from or common eccentricity problems or eccentricity related oriented problem for both the parabola and the ellipse and individually they are asking problems from ellipse and hyperbola and combinedly they are asking problems of finding eccentricity of ellipse and uh, hyperbola. So, total nine questions they asked under this particular area. This is very elementary, please do not neglect, do not neglect, LLR means this is length of the latest rectum. Okay. Now, my friends, as usual, as I said earlier also, tangent, normal, chord and common tangents. From that, of course, here also seven questions they asked. As I said just now, tangent to the ellipse, tangent to the hyperbola, tangent to the parab uh, hyperbola, normal to the ellipse, normal to the hyperbola and moreover common tangent and common normals and common chord, length of the common tangent, length of the common chord and all applications in the parametric form and non-parametric form. They are very, very important. Nine questions were asked and coming to auxiliary circle. Instead of asking the direct definition of auxiliary circle, they have constructed a problem in such a way that uh, the foot of the locus of the foot of the perpendicular from foci onto the tangent. That is nothing but what? Auxiliary circle only. So, indirectly, instead of asking directly from find the equation of auxiliary circle or something like that, they have convert, they, can, they have constru cons constructed the question in, in that way only. So, Definition and the concept behind the definition is very, very important. Uh, like that questions they asked in coordinate geometry. Okay, my friends. And the last one is uh, shortest distance from a point with respect to the ellipse. That means uh, what, is, what is the shortest distance from a point which is uh, outside of the point? Uh, mean, that means what? It is it is in indirectly a maximum minimum applications. It is indirectly a maximum minimum application. So, or you can uh, apply, you can solve this problem with uh, one of the property of the ellipse also. That kind of easy question they ask and uh, only one question they ask under this particular heading. Okay, my friends, this is about ellipse and hyperbola. So, I think uh, this information is very, very useful for you. If you like this one, please uh, share my, uh, subscribe my uh, Umashankar channel and I will uh, give more information and uh, once after watching this video, you please mention your uh, requirement. Uh, uh, please don't pass unnecessary comments or etc. things because uh, I am truly and honestly doing the best work for you and for your benefit only for keeping it to JE 2021 uh, uh, examination in mind. Once after getting the complete uh, detailed information of JE main uh, 2021 information or advanced information, I will give very good information regarding the strategies and schedules and some important formulae and problems of in mathematics also because as it is my subject and in the next video we will meet with vectors 3d and trigonometry analysis also once again thank you and 
this kind of information every time we are been providing for our sri chaitanya students and soon we are going to start very good batch in sri chaitanya if you have any queries please don't hesitate to ask nearest sri chaitanya branches they will guide you properly and wish you all the best thank you